Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we find Press NH now as he attempts to audit a probation and parole office in Battleboro, Vermont. And this guy has one of the nastiest attitudes I've ever seen in any frauditor. So let's sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. What's going on, everyone? This is Press NH Now over here today in Brattleboro, Vermont, at the Probation Parole Office. We're going to be conducting a First Amendment audit to see if they respect our rights to film here in public. Today's date is September 26, 2022. I've always wondered why somebody would want to audit a probation office or a correctional facility. I mean, it really makes no sense to me, considering how secure many of those locations are. I mean, are you trying to explore your future accommodations? And in my case, the closest I've ever come to being imprisoned was whenever I had a job interview for a corrections officer position in a pr local prison. I was offered a position within that prison, but I turned it down because right about the same time I was offered a position in my local school. So I really have no personal interest in what one looks like on the inside. Probably a transportation van for probation parole. If you're so interested in a van or a police vehicle, you should go to a local police auction and buy one. Then you could be cruising down the road pretending to be a cop. I mean, they have auctions like all the time in my area. I don't know about other areas. You might want to check your local paper. Help you? No, I'm all set. You could step back off of me, though. What is going on? What do you mean? Don't you don't, don't approach to, me like that. You don't get to film through a window. Don't approach me like that. Are you probation, parole? You want to hit me with the door, dude? Oh, but baby. Hey, Al, what's your problem with that? What's your name? Are you probation, parole? No. You're not. Who are you? Are you just want to approach a cameraman? I don't like you filming. Oh, that's tough. Window. It's not your window. You don't pay for this building. Mind your business. Sir, this is a private meeting. No, it's not. Yeah, it's not I'm not in your meeting. Oh, you have such a lovely, punchable personality, don't you? What are you, security? Working, is that probation parole? It is? All right. Cool. That's a nice comfy coach. Can I come on in just one minute, okay? Yeah, I'm all set for now. Are you gathering information for your future time as a pro E from your local prison? If that's the case, then please do carry on.
I want to see how your future turns out. In the corner, there's a door right past this one. That's a bathroom. Okay. It's not secure again until you, when you get to the bottom of the stairs. So it's all publicly accessible, correct? Yeah, except for the when the two doorways split, those two doorways. That's fine. I'm not going to go into any restricted area, obviously. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Okay. I appreciate it. Thank you. Here's your bathroom, they speak of. Uh, he's big enough to block the door. Come on, you can use the exercise, buddy. Oh, you are one to talk, considering that you've got a big, fat mouth on your face that really needs to be dealt with. Thanks for the insult. I appreciate the effort. Yeah. You probably should put on some deodorant, too. I can smell it through the door. Continue with the meeting, dude. He's tired already. Look at him. What is it that you're here to prove? Are you here to prove that you have the right to disrupt the daily operations of that office? Huh. The way he came at me at the door, he's got a lot to learn. Hell, if I didn't know any better, I'd swear you're a peeping Tom, the way you're looking in that window at that woman. Yep, I see that. Thank you, I appreciate it. Yep. All right, everyone, so that's going to be it over here today in Brattleboro, Vermont. What was the point of this anyway? You seem a little bit creepy, and as a result, I'm sure all the women absolutely love you.
Of course, I'm being facetious.